Hello, hello everyone. I am back to do one more video for today. But before that, um, you are on Tony's Witchy Arts and Crafts and I'm Tony. Hi, hello. So I received some happy mail today. Sorry if my energy is a little low to you guys. Um, I'm not feeling good today. But I received another box of goodies that I wanted to show you guys. <clears throat> From a really nice lady. If you're watching, thank you so much. You spoil me. Thank you, thank you. And um, it, it really did put a smile on my face. Thank you so much. Got your letter. Um, here's the first thing I wanted to show you guys is um, <laughs> her and I we we have the same same taste same likes pretty much and we're we're just we're vibing we we can read each other's minds <laughs> um, in the first package she sent me there was some paper in there that um, it had black and white stripes on it and it reminded me of Beetlejuice. And I said that. And look, look what she sent. <laughs> Some Beetlejuice cards. So, I love it. These, these, I'm keeping for myself. Okay, these are going in my, my junk journal. <laughs> so, I love it. And here's another one. I love this ribbon. That is cool. <laughs> Awesome. And I love I love the embossed paper. That was pretty cool. I just love embossed paper. I think it feels neat. Got some more random die cuts here. So those will get put in with, with the others. Oh look at this. Look at the little spider. I love spiders. <laughs> um some of these die cuts will probably even get used in my current project that I'm working on. There's a whole bunch. Okay, they're all tied together there. Oh, those are kind of cool. Look at this. Isn't he cool? <laughs> Neat. Okay. So I'll set those aside. We got a big box to go through again. So. Uh, Okay, let's see what she's got in here for me. We got some black and silver ribbon. I love it, love it, love it. That, see, I might have enough stuff I can make a Beetlejuice junk journal. Wouldn't that be cool? So let's see what, what else we got in here. Got some more sticker keys, and these, these are way cool. I'm going to definitely use those in my um, project that I'm working on. Those would match. <gasps> and I got another little witchy. Isn't she adorable? Love it, love it. <gasps> Ooh. Look at this. I love anything with moon and stars in it and just a little moon goddess there. Oh. I might have to stamp that one in my little witchy joke journal that I have for myself. My little book of shadows. That's beautiful. I love it. Got some little witchy hats here. I know these are used for cupcakes, but I, I usually buy those cupcake decorating things anyways. And you can just rip these little sticks out and use the embellishments. Cool, cool. Love that. And look at this. She sent me some Tim Holtz dies. But this is not, this is the oxide. I don't have an oxide yet. I don't. So that's going to be fun to play with. Yeah. I just have, oh, <laughs> I just have these little miniatures. One fell apart. There we go. 
So I haven't tried the oxide ones. That's going to be interesting. Yeah, that's going to be fun to play around with, huh? Okay, let's see what else is in here. Okay. Some more ephemera pieces. Ooh, that's cool. Kind of raised. I like that. Nice. A lot of these would be good for card making too. Got some more die cuts here. Love that. That looks like a little zombie girl in there, huh? And glitter, glitter, glitter. <laughs> So these are going to get put in the glitter box because I keep all the glitter paper together because I'm obsessed. Oh, look at these little ghosties. <laughs> Those are cute. Some more paper. Oh, little kind of parts here. Purple stars. I love the purple. That's cool. I like that. Awesome. Some more stamps. Oh, there's another little witchy. Those are cute. I'm going to have to make some Halloween cards too. Oh, here's a little paper pad. Let's see if I can get in here. Nice. I love the um, 6x6 paper pads too. I have a whole bunch off to the side here. Um, these are perfect for card making. I love that. Cool. Uh-oh, I see something. Look, guys. Look, look. <laughs> you know how hard it is to find this paper pad? I mean, it came out several years ago, so it's not even being sold anymore. This is the Graphic 45. Um, yeah, it is the Rare Oddities collection. So this <laughs> is definitely going to get used in my project that I'm working on. <laughs> That is so cool. Oh, I love it. Oops, sorry, I bumped the camera. Oh, wow. Love it. Oh, thank you so much, girl. Thank you, thank you. This is going to be awesome. Ooh. Ooh, look at that. That's cool. It's got like the vintage. It's all vintage. Ooh. This one's got a lot of purples in it. Huh? Look at that. That is cool. Oh, wow. And see, there you go. There's that image of that cabinet that we're trying to get. That's cool. Oh, wow. That's cool. Is it me or does do these look like floating pumpkins? I know they're like, they're supposed to be hot air balloons. But that's cool. <laughs> awesome. Now, okay, these, this is a different collection right here. It still will work though. I almost thought it was the same collection, but it looked sl just slightly different. That's cool. Some more cut aparts there. I like the gears. I like the gears in there. Awesome. Oh, that is a huge treat. Thank you, thank you. Those paper pads are really hard to find. You pretty much gotta like. See, if anyone is trying to get rid of theirs, you know, you got to really scour the internet for <laughs> sellers. Oh, and she sent me... Okay, I have to open this. Pretty sure this is a one of those uh, shimmer pins. Let me find... Find something to write on. Because I have to test it out. Because I'm obsessed. Okay. I was like, how do you open it? 
Okay. This thing is so cool. Okay, how do you use it? How do you use this thing? Oh, well, you gotta take the lid off. A little cap, huh? Okay, well, uh, I can't open anything today. My hands aren't working right. <laughs> we'll check that out later. Sorry, guys. Okay. Let's see what else is in here. Okay. Bunch of goodies. Now, these kind of look like coffins. They have these little slits in them, so I think they might be like labels. Yes. That's cool. Okay. Um, oh, that's cool. You make uh, treat bags that look like brooms. That's cool. I think I might save these ones for my husband. Um, he does a lot of candy making around the holidays. And so... When he's done making his candies and we get them all wrapped up, we can stick them in these and hand them out. I like it. That's cool. I like anything witchy. Got some more stamps here. Nice. Ooh. Some more. Some more Halloween paper here. Ooh. I think... Some of these um, 12 by 12 sheets were in the first package she sent me. And these are the smaller. Now these ones right here are perfect, perfect for card making. You don't even have to cut, cut it down any. Just stick it on a card base and you're good to go. Ooh, I like that. I love the colors in these. Got some more ribbon. I love making stuff with a ribbon. What's that? Um, Rockstar. Oh, that's cute. Rockstar. Okay. <laughs> Got some pencils. Um, straws. And the, um, people do all kinds of things with these straws. You can um, make them into wands, put like rosettes on the tip of them, make them like rosette wands. Or you can cut them down and use these as um, the base to your boho beads too. So you can do all kinds of things with the straws. Um, even Dollar Tree sells the straws you can use them now too. Got some flowers. Now, how did you know, girl, that I love taking these plain white flowers? Uh, Dollar Tree has plain white flowers, too. But I love taking these, and I love dyeing them different colors. Yes, and they're perfect. They're the paper, so they, they take the dye really well. Um, I love dyeing these and uh, making layered flowers. And then I love brushing on glitter. How pretty would that be? Make a bunch of those up. Put some in here too. Thank you, thank you. I can definitely use those. And there's so much stuff in here, guys. Like I said, um, from from the first package, uh, I put a couple items from that first package into my drawing that I'm doing my birthday challenge giveaway. So if I see something in here that I like to put in there, I'll, I'll put a few more items. So you guys, um, if you're watching this and you haven't got into my birthday challenge giveaway yet, you better. So many cool things. Look at these glitter bats. Little horse. Little horsey. I, I'm definitely going to save the horsey one for myself. Um, for my personal journal because... Uh, 
the um, the goddess that I work with. Her name is Goddess Rhiannon, and she's a horse goddess. So that's perfect. Ooh. I like that. It's got like an old vintage feel into them. That's cool. The skeleton. That's cool. Oh, I'll, you know what? Yeah, I bet he moves around. That's cool. I like that one. Oh, that's neat. Oh, I was like, wait, I recognize that paper. It's from this collection right here. Yeah. Oh. It kind of looks like it, but that's a different company and that's a different. Maybe they did one similar one year, but those are really cool. I like those. Cool, cool. <laughs> He's not cute. Look <laughs> at this little gremlin guy. <laughs> cute. Can you guys see that? Look at those. That. Those are adorable. The one that my eye just zoomed in on was this. Okay, right there. <laughs> those are cute. Okay. There's more, guys. There's more. Oh. I'm so, so thankful. Ah, oh, those look like fabric stickers. That's cool. Yeah, you can like, you can distress the edges of the sticker. That would be cool to put in a Halloween journal. That's definitely one of the things on my list now. I'm going to make a Halloween journal. These are cool too. These are like cardboard stickers. Nice. Oh, wow. I love that. I don't know if it's... Uh, yeah, I've never been into, like, vintage-y things, but when it comes to the holidays, and I see vintage, vintage holiday theme stuff, doesn't matter what holiday is, it kind of takes me back to, like, my childhood, like, when I was back in the 80s. Um... Have you seen some of the costumes that they sold for children <laughs> in the 80s? <laughs> but yeah, they're kind of, yeah. Look at that. She has the coolest stuff. My goodness. I would love to see your art room, girl. You have the coolest stuff. I love this. I love kitty cats and black cats. It's cool. <gasps> Ooh. I love like the goth look too. Just screams out like haunted mansion type stuff. I love it. Here's a sp spooky tree. Oh, that's a die cut. Okay. It's not a sticker. Ooh. I bet this is a sticker though. That's beautiful. Oh, goodness. My brain is just going to keep adding to the list of things I want to make. <laughs> Look at this kitty cat. Uh, oh, I think one of the embellishments I wanted to sh show you guys how to make um, this coming up, like, fall season, is how to make um, pumpkins. Pumpkin um, embellishments. I love pumpkin embellishments. And some more glitter. See, are, oh, these are these are cards. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Alright, my pen pals are gonna get some glittery cards <laughs> for Halloween. <laughs> oh, love it. Ooh, what's this? Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, girl. Did you make this? I bet she did. She made this. 
You get here. Let, hold on. Let me show you guys the one I made uh, three years ago. I love when it comes to jewelry. I love beadwork. I love it a lot. Um, never learned how to make it until about three years ago when uh, a friend of mine gave me a book. And I like, taught myself how to do it, just reading um, a beaded book. <laughs> Isn't that cool? <laughs> I love it. I only wear it out to like very special occasions, but yeah. So this one is gonna go right next to mine on my bookshelf. That's beautiful. I love it. Awesome. <laughs> I feel like a kid in a candy store. Got some cards. Now, how cool would those bats look if I put some glitter, glitter paper behind it? That'd be cool. <laughs> And these, these are perfect items for pen pal mail. Love it, love it. A couple ones, and there's one right here. Awesome. Let's see what we got here. Some papers. Oh, they kind of have a shimmer to them. Okay, can you guys see the... It's not glitter, it's just a shimmer. I love that. Oh, is it a whole pad? Oh, it is. Oh, that is so cool. Ooh. Yeah. That's cool, guys. It's shimmer paper. And then these are tags. Oh, wait. I saw a postcard in there. Postcard tag. That would be cool for pin pal mail, too. Oh, looky, looky. Now this is a special item too. Ooh. Look at that. Here, I'll, I'll take the cover off that one. Um, this, I'll have to do two projects now. Two big projects. I've got one started already. But... Um, I'm now starting to figure out what I want to make everyone for Christmas presents. So this might, I might have to make this up. Okay, so this is the, it's a Tim Holtz product. And you, it's like a shadow box or like a, a shelf shadow box. You can rearrange the squares. That's so cool. And I haven't told you guys yet, but the project that I'm working on now is going to have fairy lights in it too, so it's going to light up. And I have enough fairy lights where I can use some on my project that I'm working on now and then use it on this one too. Um, my daughter's boyfriend's mother, uh, she had a whole bunch of fairy lights, so I have enough to make five different projects. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to have so much fun. So okay, this is going to have to go on my list of to-dos. Because <laughs> I already have something in mind. <laughs> and you guys will just have to continue watching my videos to see what I do with it. Here's some more ink. Oh, good. Is this is this black ink? Cause my black ink pad was running out. <sighs> some bling bling. I love bling. Oh, here's a little die cut guy. This little guy was trying to go rogue. Get back up in there. It's my pretty ribbon. <gasps> in black lace. Oh, oh. It's a mask. <laughs> That's cool. Maybe I'll do like a Halloween video 
in October. And I'll wear wear a black mask. That's cool. Let's see, what's this? Oh. Okay. Is it this? what I could do with these. Have, have any of you guys uh, been seeing videos out there about people um, using those uh, memory decks um, roller machines that used to be like back in the like 70s and 80s but they're now they're now decorating memory decks cards and putting them on their own little memory decks holder and the ladies are getting so creative with those, but for some reason that reminded me of the memory decks stuff. So I have not tried anything like that yet, but here's some more paper. Oh, this one's two-sided. Cool. Ooh, I like that page. That's cool. But I um I wouldn't know where, because I, I mean, all the counter space here in my room is pretty much taken up. So I wouldn't know where to put the memory decks machine that, that holds them. Ooh. Gotta open this one up. Anything sparkling and shiny, I get so excited. I'm like a little, like, fairy. I don't Or have you guys seen Over the Hedge? It's like a, I don't know if it's Disney movie or not, but um, there's this squirrel that's always like very hyper. And, like he's like, gets distracted easily. Oh, nuts. Or, you know, um, so when it comes to glitter, I'm like, ooh, glitter, you know, everything else just <laughs> melts away. But this, oh, look at this. That is cool. This one kind of gives me like mermaid vibes. Blue Lagoon. Ooh, look at the pink. That's beautiful. I love that. Nice. I can even like make some fairy wings with these. Wouldn't that be pretty? Alright. I'll put that back in. My desk is getting packed here. And we still got more, guys. More, more, more. Look at this little witch's hat that was just in a random. <laughs> it's cute. Oh, he's got googly eyes. Look, they got googly eyes. <laughs> That's cute. Like a little cat. I love that one. Some, um, I think these are flat back pieces or they're called uh, resin, resin pieces. That's cool. Got a little witchy. She gave me a lot of stickers. Love, love, love stickers. I'm obsessed. If, um, I make f funny little shorts. Uh, I'm on TikTok too. So you guys can find me at Tony's Arts and Crafts on TikTok. I think that's what my name is. And I make funny little videos and I made one um, about my sticker hoarding. <laughs> I think TikTok is just more of a, a, a very fun, playful platform where you can just play around with your camera when you're bored. <laughs> I love these leaves. Oh, that is so cool. Wow. I love... Anything with leaves on it too, and pumpkins, and oh, got a little little witch's broom. I have another one um back there by my um. I have a little shelf with herbs back there too, and when I spill something, I just use the little broom <laughs> to sweep it up. Hmm. 
got some more gems. Some more die cuts. Oh, is this? I bet this is a layering piece, huh? Just like that, huh? That's cool. Like that. And then another fence. Another little walking dead guy. Ooh, look at that. That's cool. That's beautiful. Oh yeah, some of those are probably layering pieces. I see, I see. Those are cool. Okay. Awesome. Um, in the first package she sent me, she also sent me this necklace too. And I did, I looked it up and this is from the Never Ending Story. The symbol. It's on the front of the book that the little boy's reading. And um, I think I watched that movie like a dozen times because it was one of my favorites when I was a little child. So, yeah. That's pretty cool. That's going to have to go on the front of a junk journal too. <laughs> Maybe I'll make my, my own never ending story like junk journal theme. <laughs> but cool, cool. Fairy tales. Yeah. Yeah, I can make a fairy tale book. Huh? Okay. Here's some more dyes. Gotta be careful. Some of this, uh, my husband brought the box in from the mailbox, and it looked like the post office man dropped it a few times or something. Those are cute. Oh, they got a little bit of texture to them, too. It's cute, cute. I tell you what, the post office service is. <laughs> I love Halloween. I do. I love it. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to keep. I might put this one in my pen pal junk journal. I have so many junk journals. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. In my pen pal one, I might need to get another one made up or something because the one that my other pen pal sent me, the one I've been using, is getting pretty full. This is where I put all my pen pal makes. When, when my pen pals send me stuff I want to keep safe for myself, it goes in this journal. <laughs> and it's getting really full. Whoop, got some little die cuts here. And there's some paper. Hold on, guys. There's some paper in the bottom here I need to dig out. Okay, it looks like she sent me some more papers. Let's see if I can scoot them under here. Awesome. And there's this tiny little ring in there, too. Not pretty? Yes, 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 yes. Okay, she sent me some cut aparts, some more graphic 45, some big cut aparts. That's pretty. These look like they might be, yep, those are border, border strips. Some more cut aparts. Some graphic, ooh. Some of the, the vintage graphic 45 style. Love this image right here, that's cool. And this cute little girl down here with the black cat. That's adorable. That's just what that is on that side. Some stickers, some papers. Ooh, I like this gold. That's cool. <gasps> pumpkin patch. The pumpkin patch reminds me of Charlie Brown. You know the 
Charlie Brown standing in the middle of the pumpkin patch field, you know, welcome, great pumpkin. <laughs> love, 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 love. Okay. Some more kind of parts. Ooh, I love it. Got some spooky images and a paper pad. Okay, let me put these down in a box here. And then, I don't know if there's enough room where I can flip this around. Uh, yes. Oh. Ooh, I just saw this. I have a sheet of this. Just a single sheet, but... I think I got it at Joann's in their single sheet section. So that's pretty cool. Now I have more. So I can stop hoarding the one I have and use it. <laughs> you ever find like paper, you're like, oh, I I know what to do with it. I just don't want to use it yet because it's my only sheet. And then once I use it, it'll be gone. And so then you hoard it. <laughs> I definitely have a hoarding problem maybe. But now I have multiple. <laughs> so that's cool. Cool, cool. Thank you so much. Wow. I am truly blessed. Um, thank you so much.